francophone, anglophone, we talked a lot about the two kind of palettes of the two reflexes that we seem to have developed differently in Quebec and the rest of Canada. Do you think that is related or affected in any way by language? That because you work in French and are bilingual and because you work in English, is something about the formation of the language, the way French moves in its own kind of lyricism, whereas English is an incredible language, but is slightly, has its romantic side, but is slightly more didactic and precise. Do you think those two language roots actually affect theater expectations palette? No, I don't. I don't think it's language. I think English is capable of some of the most in inspired flights of poetry and fancy that you can imagine. Right. Uh, and I think it's deeper than language. I think it's uh, it's a cultural response to to art. It's about living in a place where, if you're an artist, you're something to be celebrated, and not a credit risk in particular, which is the way a lot of artists are defined in other cultures. Maybe um, it's a result of a lot of those things, you know. But I don't think it's specifically language. Every time you say something like that, uh, I know every time I do, I get proven wrong. Okay. Thank you, Michael. My pleasure. It was great. <laughs>